Oh, wait. Oh, what? Oh. Grow up. I busted. <laughs> Grow up. All right, guys, welcome back to High Foods. Me and PJ are going to go eat, but before we do, we thought we'd play a little game. A game. Called Would You Rather. I, I kind of like this game, actually. I'm kind of curious. All right, PJ. Question number one: Would you rather beat up a child or get beaten up by ten children? <laughs> that sucks. But they're all girl children. Like when they beat me up, I get, I get hurting. Like I'm, like in pain. Either you're in the hospital or one kid's in the hospital. <laughs> this is just a question of morals, man. I, I can't beat up children, man. <laughs> That's so unfair. I, I guess I'd have to get beat up by ten little girl children. But I do not want to be in the news or look at that. Like, hey, look at that. He's the child. Punisher. <laughs> <laughs> what if the kid was like a murderer? Ah, see, that's different circumstance. If the kid was like a, a serial killer, I'd beat him up. I wouldn't kill him though. It's a girl. And I'd detain her. I'd shake her hella hard. What if it was like uh, Emily Rose? <laughs> oh, God, I ain't even touching her. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next one. Would you rather eat dirty jalapeno with no water or constantly blow your nose with poison ivy? You can't even win at all. Yeah, you like jalapenos. <laughs> well, jalapenos get pretty spicy. I mean, my spice threshold is not that high. But then your like nose has like a rash for a while. Look, you blow your nose and close that. I think I have to do the jalapeno because like if I have rashes on my face, yeah. that's gonna suck really bad. That's like this whole area. Would you rather give up all forms of potato for the rest of your life or all forms of cheese? Oh man, French fries, hash browns, mashed potatoes. Baked potato. Scalloped potatoes. Or all cheese? All cheeses. Jeez. I get rid of the potatoes. I think I, I mean, it's tough. I mean, no, I think there are some kind of root vegetables. Like, they make uh, fries out of yuca. Uh, yeah, I mean, it would be the same, obviously. But I don't know about potatoes. I mean, I like them, but I just can't live without cheese. Can I get a number one side of yuca? <laughs> Alright, I have another one. Alright, nice. Would you rather pee out a marble oh. or poop out an apple? Oh. Oh man, that's kind of gross, but that's a good one. I'm not even gonna lie. That's like a really big kidney stone or super constipated. I think I have to go apple, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Just thinking of a marble. Ugh, what would make you choose the marble? Like how big? Like what about a cantaloupe? Oh, fuck. I'm just thinking about like you know how women give birth, bro. That I'm doesn't come out their butthole though. <laughs> babies are big, man. Think about Shaq. He's got like a watermelon. Watermelon. That's my that's my threshold. Your your threshold is watermelon. Yeah, I'm down for cantaloupe. Ah, uh, bro, I'm not down for cantaloupe. Oh god, <laughs> just go eat. I want to forget about that question. <laughs> Welcome to another episode of High Foods. We are here in Pasadena, California at the Slaw Dogs. And PJ brought me here. What do you like about this place? When I was looking on Yelp, I saw this picture of a burrito hot dog looking thing, and I just had to come and try it. So I guess we're just gonna go inside, try some really cool hot dogs, maybe a couple burgers. Let's go check it out. Alright guys, so we have our food now, and it looks so freaking good. The one that I really wanted to focus on was the TNT Super Dog. TNT! Dynamite! Sorry. The TNT Super Dog has a hot dog in there, fried egg, french fries, and I think pastrami. And then they roll that up in a tortilla. God, this just looks so delicious. Can't wait to eat this. Yeah, I just love all things burrito. There's like a grilled onions too. Oh! Let's just get it. Cheers! Mm-hmm. I forgot there's french fries in here. There's chili and cheese in here too. No, there's not. Yeah. I don't even know what to describe it. It's like salty and creamy. The textures are really good. I mean, you get the snap from the hot dog. You get the creaminess from the egg, saltiness from the pastrami, and then you have a little bit of crunch from the french fries, which is really awesome. And the tortilla is pressed down. They care here. You can tell that they care. Good show, Slaw Dogs. All right, that was so good. We're going to move on to the burger. It's called Sunday Morning Burger. All right, so this has egg, hash brown, bacon, burger, bread, pickle, stick. Oh, don't do it. Oh. <laughs> Back together? Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh Jesus Christ. Christ. We're gonna do a little dippy. Yeah. Cheers. 
touch. I get down with that too. That's good. I love all things egg. The hamburgers cook really well. You get the crisp from the hash brown they put in there. And just that egg just brings everything together. The yolk is like a glue to everything, man. Sometimes when you get a burger with egg inside of it, it's too slippery. The fact that they have the hash brown and the bacon in there to make that crispy, that cuts through all that creaminess. Anyways, this is delicious. It's not over salty. The textures are great. The bun is super soft. All together, really good burger. All right, next up, they hooked us up with these uh, signature fries that they have here. It's like sweet potato fries, with kimchi, oh. bacon, and then a fried egg on top. Ooh. All things I like individually. Let's see if I like it together. Wait, I don't like kimchi. Yeah. I'm just doing a raking technique. It's not working. Cheers. You're not eating all my stuff. You're destroying all my fries. Mm. It's good. How do you feel about the kimchi? Does it bother you? It has like a little funkiness to it. I like it. But too much kimchi, I think it would be a problem. That's a good balance. Yeah, mm -hmm. they're like, I'll give you bacon if you have some kimchi. So I'm like, okay with it. <laughs> that was great. So I think we're going to try to finish the rest of our food. Let our camera guy, Ash, eat. Our diffuser man, Levi, eat. And we'll come back to you and we'll tell you guys how everything was. We just finished eating here at the Slaw Dogs, and I must say, explosion of flavors. That is a great way to describe <laughs> it, because when you've been into the TNT dog burrito, it was just like, there's so much to process, but it was so, so delicious. It's like when you look at like a concert lineup, you're just like, oh, this, yeah. they have this, yeah. oh, this, <laughs> Kanye West, oh, what the heck, <laughs> Jay-Z, Drake, like fried egg, hot dog, french fries, pastrami, tortilla. Girl. Hell oh. That's my kind of lineup right there. So was that your favorite? It was good. I mean, as opposed to an explosion of flavors, I like it when they're able to emphasize like a couple flavors and make them really, really good. I kind of like the burger better. You know, you taste the burger, you taste the egg, and you taste the texture from the hash brown. Very simple, but it was delicious. I see your point there, but I, I don't know. I think that it was like the good kind of overwhelming when I had the TNT dog. It's kind of like when everybody rushes the quarterback. Flavors were really awesome. I mean, I would eat it again. That's like the perfect drunk food. Oh, I, I definitely think so. I agree. Anyways, thanks for watching another episode we want to thank you guys for coming along we had a great time eating here if you are ever in pasadena come by the slaw dogs we will leave a link in the description below if you do like the video please give it a big thumbs up if you guys like our videos please subscribe so you can watch all of them and if you already do please hit that bell button down below so that you can get all our notifications and we'll guys we'll see you guys next time on another episode of hype food